Oh. Oh. Where'd you go? Sheriff? What the hell? So welcome everyone to Alan Wake 2. So I, I told a, a little bit of a lie by omission in my community post. I had been absolutely planning to do this as well, but only if I got those three videos out first and I did it. I have been so excited for this game. I loved Alan Wake 1. I've played Control as well. So I am so excited to see where this goes. We're going normal. I ain't going for hard. It's nighttime too, by the way. <laughs> so lights are off and we are... We all come to a story with hopes and expectations, looking for an answer. Sometimes I'm just a massive fan of Remedy. I love what they do. Without ever knowing the full story. In a horror story, there are only victims and monsters. And the trick is not to end up as either. But trapped by the genre, we are all ripped to pieces along the way. Oh my god. I'm so uncomfortable. <laughs> this is not the story I hoped it would be. This is not the ending I wanted. That's a re reflection. Yeah, I was going to say that's a that's a mirrored image. This story is a monster. So if I and monsters wear many faces. Oh, the music. Oh, that's that's ear candy. That is beautiful. Like, ominous, but beautiful. I don't know if that those two emotions or those two things I'm feeling right now go together, but that's what I'm feeling with that music. Oh, hello. You good, sir? Uh, hang on. Sir, okay, so it turns, obviously, to protect the front. I'm trying to see who I'm looking at. I'm not trying to look at your... Like your meat and potatoes. I'm just trying to figure out who we are. Wow, this looks amazing. I really hope this translates. I I'm going to try and do some... I might make it brighter in the edit just in case what records is a little too dark. But I hope it translates. This is... Sorry, I'm, I'm getting this dude's ass right in the thing. So if I remember correctly from where we're starting... I don't know how many of you have played the Remedy games, but they all kind of interconnect. We are picking up from a point in Control where there was a DLC that went straight over Alan Wake's story. Or like, it was like a continuation. And we kind of go through and do some things with Alan kind of being there or dictating the events. Um, and it kind of ends at, at a point where they get coordinates back to this lake because the the foundation i forget their name but the foundation came out to investigate yeah okay i'm i feel like i'm gonna oh god i'm trying i'm trying to tell a story oh my stop how do i run um anyway they they came out to investigate the lake and i think they shut it down or something my memory's a little hazy um and they got coordinates um, to the lake, which, or an alarm triggered saying someone was there, which there shouldn't have been anyone, but the date was in the future, and apparently this is where we're picking up, I think? Okay, we got a sprint button. Oh, God. I don't like that. Not the voices. Oh, God. No! Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no. I don't have a flashlight. I got nothing. Alright, game saved. That's worrying. Where are we going? Oh, things are everywhere. I am so braced. I don't like clearings. Can I get inside this house? Oh, oh that's a sign. It's not a house. Uh, a light. A light. Can I go over there? I'm safe over there. Can I just hide out somewhere? I need light. I... Oh, God. Hi. Hi. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Okay, okay, run away, run away, run away, run away. Oh, God, they're everywhere. They're everywhere. Oh, God. Okay, that's not good. That's not good. Run away. Okay, we're at a light, we're at a light, we're at a light, we're at a light! No, I'm at light. 
I'm so oh god. Oh god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh shit. Oh god. No oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh shit. I don't know how much I can show of this, but all you need to know is my man um is missing a vital organ. Um Yeah, fair enough. Oh, what an opening. Okay. So, hopefully some of you are familiar. If you're not, all you need to really know... Spoilers for Alan Wake 1 if you haven't played it. Kind of. You can still kind of play Alan Wake 1 if, with what I'm about to tell you and not fully understand the whys of it. Oh, yep. Hi. Yep. Yep, got it. Essentially, Alan Wake is in a place called The Dark Place. I think that's what it's called. But it's essentially like almost like an alternate dimension where there's a dark force that is trying to, to enter the, the real world. And he gets trapped there while hey, trying to save his wife. But he essentially does it by saving his wife by allowing himself to remain trapped because you have to kind of give thought. equal exchange. There has to be a I'm price sorry, for the things. So and the dark world wrong. can influence real events. Oh my God, Mom, it's not your fault. People get and he murdering. influences it by writing. So writing stories. And everything that followed Alan Wake 1, so the DLCs that followed um, the episode in Control, or the DLC in Control, they're all essentially failed attempts of Alan trying to escape the dark place. So writing a story that hopefully will mean he can get out, but it doesn't work. This is what happens when you go on work trips, Mom. Love you too. And say hi to Casey. Tell him to stop brooding so much. Oh, the voice work is amazing. I will. Okay, and I'm not entirely sure who we're playing. Okay, yeah, I think these are the Federation people? Or the Foundation, sorry. Logan thinks you should try cheering up. All you need to think about with Control, if you're thinking Sir, of the Foundation, if you know anything about SCP, that it's basically that. That's what Control was about. It was about a, a Foundation like the SCP, essentially. It can't be a coincidence that another body turns up just as we arrive in town. Feels like the killer's leaving us a message. So are we the Foundation or are we FBI? I'm glad you're on this case with me, Anderson. It's right up your alley. You should take lead. Think of All right. me as the backup. I'm a little okay. concerned. Any words of advice? Nothing that would cheer anyone up. This dude weirds me out. I don't know why. This game looks amazing. Oh. Here we are. Cauldron Lake. I have a massive soft spot for um horror games, by the way. And ones with like a really, really good story alongside it. You've got me. A deputy was supposed to be here to show us to the crime scene. Alright. Now it's There's important to kind of look around so in these the games. Deputy? A lot of the things are kind of conveyed through lore there. or things you pick up. I'll check out that so I am going to be wandering around, but I'm... Oh, invitation. I'm only going to really, like, if I'm wandering around aimlessly for too long, I'll mainly show you anything interesting we find. So we've got to find the, the deputies first. Okay, look, can we... Okay, that's our inventory. Swallowed up by the trees. Logan's charm. Pistol. 12 rounds. We've only got... That map. Okay, we've got the map. Okay, so that's where we are. Witch's hut. I can't believe that's on an actual map. Okay. Rental cabins. All right. You're the one who to I think I hear someone. Who's talking? Could be our deputy. I can go take a look. Hey, there we go. Hey there. Hey, what's up? Casey, right? Sheriff Raker said you'd be coming by to take over the case. You're yeah, that's right. right. Anderson. I oh, am. Yeah. Interact. Anderson. I'll be leading this case. 
seems you already know my partner, Alex Casey. Okay, why is this... Right here, Thornton. Why is this dude freaking out so Thornton, much? Down at crime scene. He's not what you call the sharpest axe in the shed. Any, what can any you tell briefing? Us about the crime scene? Yeah, what do we got? Tell about the heart. I was getting to that, Thornton. The heart's gone? Well, we reckon there are some uh, organs that are currently Missing. outside the victim's person when they should be, but you know, inside. Thank you. So, <laughs> any witnesses? Were there any witnesses? Yeah, a couple out of towners. I wonder what they were doing sneaking around the woods. Oh, yeah, okay, so those were the people that ran away. Okay, okay, my man. City folk, right, Thornton? But don't worry. So, Sheriff from what Baker I can tell, I think our character that we were playing, the like the, the dude that was How running, he there? started in oh, the dark place, sure, that's real and then things crossed Just over into the, the real fence, world. Down the hill towards the lake, around the old convenience store, you can't miss it. Everything's been closed since the area was fenced off. Okay. The store, the campground, all of it. Yeah, the FBC, the Federal Bureau of Control. That's it. So that's what you've got there. You can see that on the sign there. Oh, I was trying to just get close to the sign, but if if you looked at it when I said it, it just said, yeah, if you go Before back, you'll see Federal scene, FBC. To review the facts of the case so far. So yeah, sure that's I'm the lake. The clues, clearly. Okay, case board. Oh, okay. The mine place. Oh, the we mine got like a mine palace. Mine palace technique. To sift through clues and work the case. I like Building this. The mine place again for each case. Using each field office as a model in my head. This is a super useful technique if the you do want to re remember things. Um, it's just... It's exactly as she said. Like, basically, you build a space you're very familiar with. And you essentially store memories in there and associate them with a particular spot. Um, if you're good at it, apparently you can... I don't know how true it is. I do know it's an effective memory technique, but you can kind of almost never Everything forget anything. About the previous murders. Apart from the victim, from going missing in 2010, the victims have nothing apparent in common. So they all went missing in 2010, found in 2012, found in 2018, uh, went missing in 2010. Interesting. Okay. Oh, visiting the mind palace place does not pause the game. Good to know. To the crime scene. Anything up here? Can we just wander off? Yeah. I'm yeah, gonna go can. check something out. Be I don't know back. what I'm checking out, but I'm checking it out. I'm wondering if there's something. What is this? What is that? A bit creepy. This place is meant to be sealed off. There's no way this should be here. All right, we're just gonna wander around. I think this loops us back up with the trail. Oh, hello. Is that a kid's lunchbox? An Cold Alex case. Casey movie lunchbox. Casey My dad used to say. About coincidentally having the same name <laughs> as a fake detective. When the he going gets tough, Casey the tough books. get going. Not sure where he the really tough get going to, but maybe you'll find it inspiring. <laughs> oh wait, what's that? Manuscript fragments. What are those? Manuscript fragments can be used to upgrade weapons in the mine place. Good to see you still in one piece, Anderson. Oh, there we go. Course, found you. Dangerous place. Not I found some manuscript stuff, you know? <laughs> it's uh it's it's, it's very interesting. Thing. Damn. Should have brought an umbrella. I like the rain. The only thing around the here. The audio design cold. is amazing. You think the local law had the sense to put up a tarp? Hmm. If they did. Phone booth. Next coffee's on me. Hey, how you doing? That's me, at your service, ready to get this case solved. Where's the crime scene? behind the store. Come on, I'll show you. So is this where it happened? No, there's not enough blood. Oh no, this was the village oh. we were trying to get to. FBI, huh? That's so cool. I'm how glad you think so. Psycho serial killers and shootouts with the mob? Yep, that's that's how that works. Those are real. Yep. You guys hiring? this body, shall we? All right, there it is. Okay, let's start by examining our guest of honor. 
All right. Does this fit the MO of the previous murders? Heart removed from chest, strapped by the wrists. Definitely matches the previous murders. Okay, so it's this consistent. Time the and the straps were left behind. They were what interrupted. With? This makes four murders that we know about. So they were, yeah, they were interrupted by those people hiking. Were they just hanging out, waiting? What Someone we got? Someone left in a hurry. Knocked the tripod over. Were they filming? Was it for a camera? Someone was drinking beer. Okay. They spent time here. Waiting. Okay. So, let's go to the case board. Let's have a look. What have we got? So, first up, well, we need to go to... We need this one. And this is for the killers. Multiple sets of footprints. Heavy blood splatter on the... Nope. Uh, the killers? Yep, yeah, okay. Footprints Heavy blood splatter. Multiple assailants multiple present. Killers. Messy scene. Quite Crime and passion premeditated. I'm saying premeditated. Absolutely premeditated. Like, they were, they were chasing. Okay, let's get out of here. Um, let's try and find out if, uh, our favorite man over here knows anything. Any idea who the victim is? Oh, I sure do. His you name do? is Nightingale. Nightingale. He, FBI. he came to town about 13 years ago. Now, I haven't heard a word about him since. Well, until now. Nightingale? Nightingale. Robert Nightingale? Oh, yes. You probably knew him. Brothers in arms. Uh-huh. Oh, and sisters. He was an agent? Didn't recognize him in his current state. But yeah, I ran into him a few times at Quantico. Okay. Work any cases together. After his partner got killed in the field, he went off the deep end. Nightingale missing since missing 2010. Years ago. So 2010. same same, same as the other, the victims. other victims. Certainly fits the pattern. Makes me wonder what was going on that year. Probably I don't know. Something this town wants to forget. Premeditated or spontaneous? They were sitting here waiting. So it's premeditated. Like they weren't... It's not like they just happened upon him and did something. They had a camera set up and everything. <sighs> Gotta they be premeditated. To happen here. Passing the time with equipment ready. Yep. They were waiting for him. But why Nightingale? He's been missing for 13 years. Why here? You have not yet Why now? contemplated the supernatural. Victim came from. Huh? Profiling. Here we go. Get into the subject's head. See what they saw. Feel what they felt. Oh, uh, yeah. Use whatever I know about them to guide my intuition to a revelation. All right. Together. I don't like that ant that deer head. Okay, profiling. Let's go. Alright. Guess Nightingale it is. I don't really want to relive this. Agent Nightingale Missing person. Alright, how does this work? How did he end up here? That's the first question. Up from the lake that's not a lake. It's dark. He was there too. You are not allowed in the lake until he says otherwise. Is that Alan? Robert How did we find that out? From the lake before his murder. How did we figure that out? Oh, I don't like the noises. Oh, I'm so on edge. Chosen as the victim. Why? Like the switch, it goes click. Lights are off. At somebody's home. Oh my God. Somebody's home. This wasn't some random act of violence. This was a ritual. A nightingale, a component. They didn't see him as a person. More like a container for something. Hmm. Yeah, okay. Let's take a look down by the lake. Lead the way. Sounds good. Oh yeah, please lead the way. I don't know where I'm going. Yep, I was going the wrong way completely. Well, I'll just, uh, I'll just wait here. Thank you. Oh, God. This one of your hunches, Anderson? Sure is. Something happened at the lake. I think Nightingale came up from that direction. From a lake. Probably. I don't know how exactly. 
Safety. They were waiting for him. When you're ready, I'd love to hear what you put together so far. Sure. What's this? It's just, not that complicated. Just let me climb up? Okay. Nightingale was out in the woods alone at night, possibly nude. The killers knew he was here. Ambushed possibly him. nude? Yeah, Dragged he's him very to the nude. Strapped him to the table. Cut his heart out. But then they were interrupted by those witnesses, the bookers. Okay. The job is unfinished. That seems pretty complicated to me. Um, yeah, that's interesting that the heart is missing. Oh, yeah, the... I haven't the figured that part out yet. A witch with no heart. Interesting. A strange echo of Al murder. Hmm. I didn't know... Truth yeah, she was the main villain in, the, in Alan Wake 1. Gives me the creeps. Okay. Why are we going down here? get out more. What's this? It is kind of creepy, though. There's a piece of paper on the ground. Is it going to be a, a book? Can you zoom? Tracks. Barefoot. Nightingales? Okay. A page full of text on one side. Not a printout. Written with a typewriter. Old school. That's Alan. Lines scratched out and edits added with a pen. Okay. Mm -hmm. Like a manuscript. A page of a story. Mm. Killer left a message. What happened? It's for us. Oh shit. The text is about us. Okay. The victim was one of their own. FBI Special Agent Robert Nightingale. And then there was the page they found. The huh. first step down into terrifying depths. Were yep, here we words? go. These words felt like a message. Felt like a message. Yep, there he is. Someone knew they were here. Someone playing a game with them. An invitation. How could they not accept? Even if they knew it would end up hurting them. Oh shit. Uh, if that doesn't send a tingle down your spine, I don't know what will. Someone's been watching us. Oh, look at that. Sick game with us. You were right. This is right up my alley. Nightingale came this way. Either he dropped this page. Okay. Or the killers left it for us. Okay. Profiling about this page. Okay. What have we got? A story about these events. This is so cool. I'm. Oh, this is cool. Close to my chest now. Okay. Inside. The awful truth. What truth? You must dig it out. Oh, God. Something was put inside him. In Something his chest. Something was put inside in his chest. I must find out what. Yeah, so we're going to have to put on our thinking caps a, a little bit. Something was in the chest. So we went to the lake, but we couldn't get down there. We found the manuscript. The manuscript indicated something in the chest. Hello, take it to the morgue. Deputy. Morgue. I want the body taken back to town for a proper examination. What an opening, ASAP. though. This is well, sure. insane. The won't be back in town for another week after Deerfest. Not a problem. I'll do it myself. Oh, and Sheriff Breaker called to say he's got the bookers at the Oh Dear Diner in town. Thank you. Oh, and I've got a key to the gate. It's a shortcut back to the parking lot just up the hill. Okay, the facial animations were really good. The expression on his face while he was looking around. I am... I, w I don't know what Thanks. I was expecting, but I'm so happy. This is such an interesting let's get the start. Car. Drive to Bright Falls. All right, let's go. Talk to these witnesses, the bookers. At the diner, right? I, I could use a cup of coffee. Let's oh, and it switches to comms when Sounds you're far good. away. <gasps> oh, okay. What a nice little touch. It switched to comms when we were a bit further away. All right, yeah, let's get out of this forest. It's giving me the creeps. All right, let's go. Oh, yeah, here it was again. Uh, FBC security perimeter gate authorized. The federal I can't Bureau read. Of control? <laughs> yeah, the That's Federal Bureau of Control. Toxic volcanic gas, huh? The FBC is an obscure branch. Only shows up for unusual cases. Well, what's this unusual would be unusual. Gas? Beats me. <laughs> All right, we went around this way. I think I'm stuck. Oh, there we go. Okay, we're good. All right, we made it. Here we are. Let's drive back to town. And meet yeah, the let's get the diner. let's let's blow this joint because uh, it's beautiful. Don't get me wrong, but there's the eeriness of it. 
Everything from the atmosphere, like the audio design, everything. I've never seen killers reach out so directly before. Literally. Damn impressive work so far. With your technique, these hunches were moving fast. I wasn't sure about taking a case so far from home, but I'm thrilled to be here for this mystery. Thrilled to be here for the mystery. You are going to regret those words, I promise you. All right. So we're away we from all that nonsense and we're back in the, the town. Office? No, I'm all set. I'll park there anyway. I want to walk to the diner. Okay, it looks like they got a little fair going on. There, dear fest. Oh, that's what the deputy was talking about as well. I'm wondering how long until everything really starts going. Let me guess. The FBI. What gave it away? The jacket? It's nice to have you here. I, I couldn't be more obvious. Oh, it's Washington's finest. You promise? Nice to meet you, Sheriff. I'm set for coffee. You know, I wouldn't say no to another. There we go. I'm Agent Saga Anderson. This is Agent Alex Casey. Okay, we're very Tim close. Breaker. I'm going to step up and a little, step back a little. I'm happy you two are here. Frankly, we can you use sure? help. Your deputy All right, said so we got the witnesses, witnesses inside. They made Look at that. You can just like see suspects. inside over there. Mulligan and Thornton are still on about that. This is such a no, cute little no, town. The don't strike me as the murdering type, but you can decide for yourselves. I love this. They're just inside having coffee and pie to calm their nerves. I'll see what they have to say. Yeah, fair enough. Casey, I mean, we've got to question everybody. Even, even hey, if they don't seem to be the type, we've got to ask the questions. All right, where are you? I can't right. believe that happened. The bookers. Here we go. Excuse me. I'm Agent Saga Anderson. Yeah, these were the two who Agent were up the on the cliff and then stumbled in on everything. I'm Tammy, and he's Ed. Hello, officer. Nice to meet you. Just Saga is fine, Ed. So, are we being charged with anything? Because if not, we'd love to get back to our hotel and decompress after what we saw. We got to ask some questions. I'm sure clothes, you can understand. Kind of yeah, one hundred percent. But we need to ask some questions. questions. Nothing to stress about. Okay. All right, why were you at Cauldron Lake? Because you were there were you at night. at Cauldron Lake last night? I'm a writer. True crime. We're here from New York, doing some research a on the novelist Alan Wake, who went missing here. I was Fair down enough. at the lake, getting some details. Perfectly legal. That's not what we were... I mean, I, I feel like you kind of went into the fence that you're not supposed to go into. So what did you see in the woods? This naked dude came out of the lake. Okay. He was acting crazy. Shouting yeah, because they were there from the very beginning when he we played that opening. Something. Unless skinny dipping at dawn is a thing around here. Then we heard shooting. All right, lady, listen. I know it's been a rough night, but I'm just trying to do my job. Masks. They were cheering into the naked guy with knives, like some kind of satanic cult. I appreciate the amount of detail then you're going into, Ed. And call the cops. Yeah, that was the right call. Why what do you think it was, you say a it was a cult? The masks and knives aren't enough. We need every detail. They were shouting, cult up the tree. Yeah, see, a thank you. That's something tree. I can work with. Ed, listen to me. I know it's been stressful, then but I'm just, I need to do this. The whole thing was terrifying. Okay. That's all. Why did we get that weird flash? All right, thank you. Thank you, Ed. Ed specifically. Thank you. All right, we're going to move on. All right, let's go into the mine place. Uh, the cult of the tree. Of let's the get tree. some information. I'm guessing wow, she's got some sort of supernatural me. touch or something. The symbol is two triangles. The cult wants there we go. Spruce tree back, Tammy. Finder's keeper is Ed. Huh? My publisher will want this on the cover. Tammy found something. There we go. A necklace belonging to one of the cultists. That's something. The bookers were at Cauldron Lake. Why? This was built to hide what's there. Do they know? They say the rider fell in the lake. Private party. Okay. No trespassing. My book has questions. Pass this the is so pass. creepy. They broke in for the sake of Tammy's book. Right. Nothing to do with the murder. Yeah, so nothing to do they with the murder, the but... Truth. Excuse me, I need to ask. I think you found something. So you found something there, right? A necklace these cultists may have dropped. <laughs> okay. Wow. How did you put that together? It's evidence. You need to hand it over. 
<laughs> Told you not to keep that heat in me. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thanks. This could prove to be helpful. Also, obstruction of justice. Favor. Stick around town for now in case we have any more questions. <laughs> like we'd even dream of missing you. Oh, God. Why are you Saga? so... Saga Anderson. Oh, wait. We actually know you. I thought it was some weird stuff. I thought we'd never see you back here after that awful, awful thing happened to your baby girl. What are you referencing? How are you? You uh, are weirding me out. I'm sorry. Who are you? I don't know what you're talking about. It's me, silly. Rose. You know me. No. I don't think I do. And what horrible thing happened to my baby girl? She drowned your daughter. <sighs> That's so weird. You don't remember. Uh oh. How do you know I have a daughter? Oh, yeah. What, what this is. the hell? You're blocking out your traumatic memories. What is going on? on TV all the time. No. You're mistaking me for something. We, we were talking to our daughter at the beginning, right? <laughs> If you say so. Okay, strange lady. What the hell just happened? You you leave me alone. Looks like we're dealing with a cult. Well, that's nice. The cult of the tree. A murder cult. Apparently. Fuck. They like to drink beers and record murders. Sheriff? Only the urban legends. If you're in the woods at night, the cult will get you. That sort of thing. That's an urban legend. We're okay. When did that start? Are we? I played some D&D back in the day. <laughs> Me too, my dude. Morning, Sheriff. Looks like you have some guests. Look how gorgeous this is. I really hope YouTube doesn't mess this up too much. I, I, I hope you can all see how incredible this looks. Why? What you do now? She kept saying that my daughter drowned. She even knew my name. It was all very weird. I feel like maybe that's future things getting messed up. Best not to take it personally. Yeah, fair enough. I feel like we have some sort of supernatural gift. Like that's what these hunches hey, are. Corpse is downstairs, ready to go. And I'm guessing this is the. So morgue. we share a morgue with the funeral next door. So makes sense. Budget. Makes sense. You guys don't funeral have that uh, makes sense. Our Small town. Rotates between a few other towns, and he's away this week. But you can handle this, right? I'm yeah. qualified to perform examinations. Yes. Fair enough. Fun story. I think I've spoken about this before. But Something I used to work in funerals at one point. Uh, it was my first job out of high school. I can't say I feel the same. He's Very interesting line of work. Let me tell you. <laughs> what what cause of death? Can the body give me? I mean, I feel like the missing half's important. Writing, here. writing? Okay. Can't make it out. Writing? How did they manage uh, that? Can I zoom over here? No, okay. The body shows signs of being submerged in water post mortem. Post mortem, but he was on the table the entire time. Uh huh. What's this? They did leave something inside his chest. What? What got left? I don't see it. Okay. This uh, looks like text. More. Okay. A tattoo? Nightingale didn't strike me as a tattoo guy. Okay. Defensive wounds. Yeah, obviously from trying to protect himself. That is probably going to be learn anything from the body. Ritual writing. We're probably going to look at doing that for the heart as well. Yep, there we go. Okay. Text is smudged. Tattoos on body Looks and heart. Inverted. How do the killers have time? Doesn't heart make sense. Exactly. Because they got interrupted and ran immediately. They didn't have time to do any of this. All right. Well, obviously, chest rip open that's probably what got put in there something visible inside okay we haven't actually got there yet bloating of the joints indicates long-term <sighs> underwater exposure yeah which is There's weird something in his chest Did it's the like the timelines are wrong cause of bloating unknown strange tattoos on skin something was inserted into the chest cavity chest trauma is clear cause of death all right what do we get not a manuscript.
Okay. It's the same type of page we found at Cauldron Lake. Here we go. Nightingale hunted Saga. Didn't see her. The Taken could not see into bright light. Right. Light hurt them. Made them vulnerable. Nightingale had no heart, but here he was. Killing. What? Someone's created a fucked up fantasy about us. Apparently. Hey, hold on. We found these kinds of pages. Oh, wait, you got more? I didn't think they were relevant to this case. I have them right here. You found more? You got a whole binder of them? Hold on. Uh oh. Okay, we're getting into it. No, 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 wait. Oh. Oh. Where'd you go? Sheriff? Oh god. Oh my god. Oh shit. No 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 no. Saga, come on. Alright, we're down but we're not out. Come on, we gotta get up, we gotta get up. Light. the fuck is going on didn't see her there it was Could not see into bright light oh god that just flipped that completely flipped in like a second here i am investigating oh for what here i was just investigating and now we're here yeah, fair enough. No weapon. Page said to get into the light. Yep, on it. Into the light. Into the light. Trying to stay in the lights to avoid being detected by enemies. Oh god, we're just straight into. So I gotta stand here. Oh my god. He can't see me in the light. Okay. This is terrifying. This is terrifying. Okay, go, go, go. Safe havens will restore some of your health. If you leave or attack from a safe haven while in combat, it will become temporarily unavailable. Now. Okay, go, 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 go. Give me the gun, give me the gun. Aim. Okay, there we go. Headshots. What do you mean waiting for me? Holy shit. Uh, oh. Oh, my heart. It was just tense. That's, that's all I can tell you. That was just tense. So, so tense. Okay, he we're back here. He didn't have a heart, but he still got up. The page okay. predicted all of it. It helped me fight him. Oh, oh, oh. He, he you all right? Disappeared. What the hell is going on here? I don't know. We need to figure that out if we're going to do anything. I don't know. Hang on. Was back Hang on. I got to collect Lake. my thoughts. Saga had to pursue Nightingale into the overlap. Find your way in with the difficult. overlap. A ritual. Saga would learn how. Stop the monster. Oh my God. Oh, okay, yeah, what happened right to the sheriff? Got crazy, sheriff Breaker just vanished. Maybe the sheriff knew more than he was letting on. Hmm. He seemed anxious, like he dreaded what was coming. One more mystery. Holy shit, There's we were attacked no by a dead man. Explanation to what we just saw. Nope. I'd love to blame this on mass hallucination caused by inhaling volcanic <laughs> Like the F FBC said. Bullshit. This was supernatural. Well, I'm glad you were the one to say it. Now we can figure out a way forward. Is this the, the work of the cult? The ritualistic murder turns into a monster. Is there a connection? Looks to me like Maybe. the cult of the tree is performing rituals to create monsters. How do you know? Mm, How do you know that? 
Answer the question. We start with learning this Answer the question. Their purpose. Oh my god, okay. Uh, case board, obviously we've got new things to think about now. Uh, yeah. Let's put this down. Nightingale attacked us. Light as a way to fight him. Pages yep. predicting the future. There's no rational explanation. None whatsoever. This is this not a is standard case FBI case. Solve. Dear God, this is so cool. I love this. But I think I'm going to leave it here. I wanted to try and keep this one shorter. I don't know how long this is going to be because I, I'm going to have a hard time trying to cut things out. But I think I'm going to do at least one more part. But if you're if you're interested in kind of keeping this one going, um, please do let me know. I've been so excited for this and I, I can't wait to... I can't wait to share it with you all, so please leave your comments down below. Leave a like if you enjoyed the video, and subscribe if you're new. And to find out what happens next, you got to tune in. But that's all for today, so bye for now.